So I'm here to talk about uh, life, you know, uh, the losses that we go through in life. And I want to tell you guys that losing in life, everybody hates to lose. But when we lose, that's what defines our life. You know, uh, the losses, the, the rejections, the failures, those are the things that make us. You know, if we won and we were successful at every single thing that we did, like life would be completely boring. We would have nothing to, you know, talk about. We would have no reason to go back to the gym if we succeeded every time. We would have no reason to uh, to talk to that, that girl because we would get the first successful attempt with that one girl because we're succeeding at every single thing that we do. So what I'm trying to get to you guys and point out to you guys is so many people say, oh, I hate the way my life is going. I hate this. I hate that. Well, guess what? Life is meant to be the way that it is, you know? I wouldn't have it any other way, you know? I love, I love being able to go back and do something all over again and you know fail at it and just have had that hunger to go back and do it again you know that's why i love fitness so much you know it's the pain it's like literally when i'm tearing the muscle down i'm thinking in my head with that mind and muscle connection like man you know like my gains are about to come back so strong and that's what you guys are going to do in your life you're going to go through things you know you're going to lose people and that's fine you know because every single time you lose you come back stronger you know you know, we expect so many promises from so many different people, but we can't keep the promises that we have made to ourselves. Um, you know, we want somebody to um, follow through on being faithful or whatever the reason may be, but we can't keep the promises that we make to ourselves. We want to, we say, oh, I'm going to get fit. Oh, I'm going to stop smoking. But we're going right to the store to get that pack, you know. Uh, we say we want to get fit, but we're not going to the gym. We're not training at home. We're not eating right. You know, so one of the reasons why I love being a social media influencer is the fact that, you know, I can get these people fired up every single day to want to do that. You know, I would rather have them um, listen to me and tell them to get fit than the doctor sitting them down and telling them, hey, you know, uh, you got to get fit or else. You know, so I figure that's one of the reasons why I started this thing. At first, you know, it was, you know, oh, I want to, you know, I want to be famous. I want to do it. But now it's not, it's, it's the DMs, at constant, every single day. Oh, you know, like, uh, you changed my life around, you know, it was this woman, you know, she had cuts all over her body, you know, uh, she would cut herself. And you know, it, that she stopped doing that because of me. Um, it's, it's being on Twitter and uh, this woman is literally getting her stuff thrown out of her house at that very single moment. And she's like, oh, you know, I'm trying to tell her, like, hey, it's going to be fine. You know, you go, blah, blah, blah. And how can I say that, you know, when I'm not going through what she's going through, you know? But eventually, two weeks later, guess what? She ended up moving with one of her family members. And she ended up moving to a bigger house, a better house than what she had, you know? It's the losses that define us. It's not the wins. It's the losses. It's the reason to go back. So that's what I want you guys to understand that. Life is not all about winners, not all about having the best cars, the best jewelry, and the best girls. It's not all about that. Because there's so many rich people that are unhappy, and they have everything. They can travel whenever they want. They don't have to work a day in their life. They don't have to do a labor job. That's what it's about. The losses are what define us.